When we first started this project, um, we chose it because we realized that we all kind of had different opinions on our time here at K-State. So we went in to look at the curriculum now and see if there were things that could have been improved or changed or if it was working just the way it is. Uh, the, the curriculum, I think, does prepare students for the real world. The current curriculum needs to be revamped and I think the current faculty know that it needs to be revamped. It's outdated. There's just a lot more catching up with the times that we need to do. In journalism we have kind of two tracks, the digital side and the print side at this time. I don't know that it necessarily thrives. The curriculum whenever I was a student seemed to be very writer friendly. For my situation I believe that the classes aren't really fit for me. To be perfectly honest, if people are strictly relying on classes to prepare them for their career, they're going to be, that's not necessarily going to be the best path, in my opinion. Going into this project, we had um, talked about and heard talk about changes or possible improvements um, from the faculty. Now, what we have analyzed as being a real strength of our program is that it begins with the greatest of intentions. One of the notations that the accreditation team left us was that we needed to be teaching stronger video production skills. Uh, it needs to be changed, needs to be changed quickly. One of the things that we felt we don't offer our lower level students is a, a skill level, a skill course in multimedia production. So we need to go back to teaching the good principles. We don't teach enough how to shoot, edit, and really manipulate video. We don't do enough in the way of doing video and using After Effects. The curriculum's been designed along those parameters. How do we do? Yeah. We, we, ha we have some areas for growth. So then there's the other side of this, the students. And some of the students, since there has been talk about possible changes and improvements, have expressed frustrations. And we don't even have a sports broadcasting program here. As it presently is, I think the curriculum has a vast amount to grow. Coming out of school didn't really feel like I got all of the video production experience that I could have. I feel like there should be more classes, more variety of classes so that people can actually follow what they're passionate about rather than just one sequence to which everybody is going to be in it. When you're a junior or a senior and you're looking for those really challenging electives, you know, I think that we just don't have a lot to pick from. I think what surprised me and the rest of my group the most was the differences in, all, in the opinions from the different perspectives of the students and the faculty. We didn't learn anything hands-on really. Part of the reason each faculty member is hired is for their area of specialty. One of the problems we have in our curriculum is faculty aren't exactly teaching some of their strengths. We need to bring in more professors that have um, different experience. And I think that's an advantage that our curriculum has right now. It's very broad, uh, not particularly deep, but it is very broad. I, I do believe there, this jack-of-all-trades curriculum does hinder the students here a little bit. You get two classes to do the newscast, but when you really start finding your passion, you're done with the two classes. We really didn't touch a video camera or editing software until deep into the class. News stations are wanting to hire one-man band. No school can be everything to everybody. That's just, that's just impossible to do. Yeah, I think there needs to be a 500 level class that is going to be full on, you know, character based narrative. There's no film or high end production kind of classes. There needs to be a, a more advanced class on how to shoot and edit video. But if students want to do that and go into ent entertainment industry or into filmmaking, then I would encourage them to really look for a different school. K-State is not set up to be a film school. We're not Hollywood. We don't have people who have that background. So what we found while going through this project is that even though there is a variety of opinions um, on where, where the curriculum is now and where it's going in the future, it's apparent that there are changes that need to be made. And that was the one thing that we really wanted to show throughout this project.